Hi, welcome to Intuit.com. I'm going to explain you uh, how many objects are created in these in these two statement. How many objects are created in these two statements? Okay. So let's see the first one, string literal. So string str1 is equal to within quotes you have given a string. Okay. So in this case, JVM searches a string pool. That is this string pool. The, for this string, in the string pool. The JVM searches to see if equivalent string exists already. If it, if the same string exists already, it returns the reference to the same. If not, adds it to the string pool and returns the reference. So a new object may be created or may not. If it exists, it it will not create. If it doesn't exist, it will create. Then the second option is using new. Okay. So now JVM has to create. An object on here because since you have placed uh, new here, it will be creating an, an object in the heap. It doesn't matter if interview dot is already present in the string pool or not. It doesn't matter. It will create uh, an object in the heap. Okay. If it does not exist, so two objects, two objects can will be created. Two or one objects will be created. Okay, based on the string pool. You can call intern on a string object. This will put the string object in the pool. If it is not already there, and return the reference to the pool string. If it if it was already already in the pool, it just returns a reference to the object that was already there. S see, uh, this is the way. This way of creating a string is dangerous because you'll be creating more new objects, new string objects. Whereas this one is very efficient. So interviewer will be asking which one is efficient. How many objects are created? Where exactly it is created? Okay, you should say here it is created in string constant pool. Here it is created in the heap. Okay, and there are, there there is a possibility of creating two objects or one objects. Here one object will be created in the string constant pool. Hope this video is useful for your Java interview preparation. If you are looking for a job opportunity within India, kindly submit your resume using the following link. Okay, you can log on to interview.com and you can click the post resume. And you can submit your resume with our job portal. Thank you for watching this video and all the best for your interview. Thank you.